Hey, hey! I've been busy. I know I say that a lot. I should probably come up with something else. But it's so true! So, last time you saw me, I was about here, and I had planks all around me. I had, uh, while well, I was trying to survive the night, I kind of did a spiral staircase and busted into a cave. Now, that's not the awkward part. The awkward part is, it was lit by natural light. So I thought that was strange. So I followed it out and it turns out there was a mouth to a cave right here. <laughs> uh, I'll come back to that here in a second. Um, so yeah, so I've been running around planting torches wherever possible. I want to keep these horses uh, alive as long as possible for as many of them as I can as possible. Um, I know they tend to fall in water and drown, so I'm hoping that doesn't happen. Um, but uh, yeah, so I've been uh, trying to get trying to get things a base of operations going here, uh, planting trees like crazy in order to get one of these going. Um, of course, you guys know me. This is like one of my first orders of business here. Get, get cows in here, and I got my pushed a donk in here, and I'm probably gonna try to. Uh, get the other get, get all the horses in here too I'll pro probably make an even bigger one uh, just for that um, one of the nice things about being in a plains and a, and a swamp together like this is it's nice and flat both of them generally uh, which which is great for things like this and for getting farms going uh, and also because slimes show up sometimes here at night so uh, I already got a couple slime balls right now I'm just waiting on string from uh, spiders, but at night it's been rather dangerous, and I am not armed at all. Well, armed a little bit. I got this off a zombie. Um, not, you know, I don't have any gear on to keep me alive. So, it's been dangerous. I kill select spiders when I can, but I'm, I'm, I am think I'm more hoping for a, uh, uh, what you call it, uh, mine shaft. But, uh, oh, and I moved my uh, crafting table that I made out here just because this makes more sense. I'm spending a lot of my time here. And I got a, um, when I was looking for this place, I just killed a few sheep. And that's how I was able to get my bed going, um, which has been really helpful. Uh, no one else is on right now, just me. This is a cave that I want to check out, though. Um, I grabbed a bunch of cows that were over there, and I've been breeding them as well. I just wanted to get enough to kind of sustain me here. So I've got... Um, I got five steak cooked up. I got an extra pick. I uh, got a bunch of torches made. So I think we should be okay to check out this cave. I'm, I don't know if it's going to connect with that one over there. Oh, uh, before we do that, I wanted to show you guys what I've done over here. Now, I have no intentions on making a man cave, but I do love having caves as a, as a first... Gosh, I always lose the entrance... <laughs> I do love having it as a first home because it makes it really easy to secure yourself because you're not building walls. All you have to do is have a doorway and I just throw, you know, dirt right there. Um, this cave actually ended at these blocks right here. Then I decided to get some materials going. Needed some cobble. And I thought, well, if I'm going to do that, I might as well, you know, I might as well, you know, dig down. Um, so, um... Went all the way to 12, like I always do, and I have not done, I have not done any branch mining. I'm going to try to resist the urge to do it, but I want to get a hold of some, uh, you know, I want to get a hold of some better materials here pretty soon, and I really didn't get, I didn't get any redstone from doing that. There's a little bit of gold down there that I have, that I have to go back and get. Um, you can see I got my slime balls, I got a little bit of iron, I made a bucket, and I realized, oh wait, I've got a swamp, I don't need a bucket, I can just put a farm right there. Because I originally had farm in here. And I realized that's stupid. Because I'm not going to bring the cows in here. So, anyway. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah. Leather from them. I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Oh, yeah. Books. Never mind. Mm, made a bunch of fences. Even though I hate making fences. Because they're... You know, you can get them so abundantly in mine shafts. But, eh. Mistakes are made. A little bit of string. I need two more string to build a lead, or make a lead, so that way with the slime ball, so I can go. Ooh, it's coming nighttime. Um, 
so I can go get um, I can go grab those horses. Uh, the cows I just did it the old-fashioned way with the wheat, which is annoying. But uh, all right, so uh, which way are we going? Oh yeah, this is really cool. Look, check out the spit that's going out there. Pretty nice, I think. I don't know if I really showed this area up around you guys, but uh, yeah, ocean. I think that might be might be desert. I don't know because there's grass among it, so it might just be more of an extension of the uh, extreme hills right there, and then the swamp and the plains. So I love this location. If I can find myself a skeleton spawner here, then it will definitely be my permanent home. But for right now, it's still kind of temporary, so I'm trying not to do too much to the terrain um, to ruin it. In case anybody ever wants this going forward, um, if I leave this place. But I did mark it. This swamp and plains have been claimed by DesiTM. So, mine. Mine, 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 mine. Alright, so, uh, we got about uh, 14 minutes or so. Let's get cracking on this cave here. Knowing my luck, it won't be much of one. Yep, there you go. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. Um, I think I saw a couple other opportunities over here. This is one of the things I do like about swamps. Swamps are probably my favorite overall biome. Um, just because they're flat, you got oak trees, which I love for food and for wood and for farming. Um, you get cows. Um, they're water adjacent for farms. They're great. Oh, and you get, you get these guys with shears, which... I should probably use my iron to make pretty soon. Floating dirt blocks. Weird. Wow, and lots of them. It's like there used to be a mountain here and it and it evaporated or exploded or something. Look at that. It's like uh, it went poof, like out here. <laughs> and then it was like, pause. Okay, so then beyond the extreme... I think these are extreme hills. I think. Yeah, extreme hills. Uh, looks like we got forest, which is good. What is this? Is this a cave? Ooh, cave. All right, mark it. Let's do it. Ooh, caves filled with gravel are always good. Always, always, always good. Jeez, I didn't realize I was going to need food so quick. All right, brighten it up in here. I'll probably have a use for this... Uh, Gravel at some point, too. Oh, yeah. Now, there was a giant cave that I can't seem to find again when I was trying to find a place to hide out. Came across it, and uh, <clears throat> it had, like, one of those uh, big chamber rooms where you can go in, like, eight different directions. So I said, the heck with this, and got out. I know I marked it, but I haven't a clue where it is, so I'll have to scour. Um... This is just so you guys know as far as the time lapse. Um, I know when the f server first started with the last with the last map I recorded, like, ooh, iron. Uh, every little moment that I did. Um, I, I know that some people still benefit from, from, from learning the basics. Uh, and I'll, I'll cover stuff as I need to, but honestly... Resource gathering, that's not really an educational opportunity. Like, hey, look, coal. Here's how you mine coal. Lesson, <laughs> lesson over. <laughs> so I don't think I need to uh, show you guys me doing that. But I will do it here because this is a cave and I don't want to forget it. Um, but, um, hang on. Oh, jeez. Whoo. <sighs> Whoa. Okay. Um, oh, jeez. Oh, crap. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Okay, I have not seen these things outside of a stronghold before. What? Oh. Hmm. Heart racing. Oh, jeez. Oh. Wow, okay. Um, I'm going to need another sword. <laughs> wow. Okay, I remember... Oh, hello, cow. I remember hearing that these guys were now elsewhere in the world, too. But that... I 
I completely forgot about that. Let's go grab me another sword. <laughs> we'll come back. <laughs> oh, that scared me. Am I this way? Ooh, is that a cave? I hear it, but don't see zombie. That would be a cave as well, sort of. Let's double mark it. We'll come back to that. Where is the big cave that I found? It's probably over that way somewhere. That's the downside to uh, swamps. It's really easy to get lost. Because it's like, oh, um, I, 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 I set up shop next to the oak tree with the vines near the water. Oh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Your specificity needs some work. <laughs> All right. Um... You know what I might do? I might just fill this thing in. Just so I'm not tempted to go, oh, what's in here? Or so, you know, I don't fall in it and die. Now, of course, one of the downsides to having a a cave home is all the hopping you gotta do. Kinda sucks, but par for the course, I suppose. Alright, we're gonna take some of that with us. Put that back. Um, let's cook some of that up. Ooh, I happen to have three, and that's what I need. Yay! We need one of those. And my crafting table happens to be back here. Is it almost... What time is it? Okay, not even noon. All right. Ah, which way? This way. No, this way. <gasps> Excuse me. Oh, uh, time lapse. Yes, sorry, forgot. Uh, this is the next morning. Um... Cherry and Evo and I recorded last night, um, so you guys haven't missed much. Uh, I just wanted to make sure that I got food. That was my primary goal. I didn't want to go caving without food. That's a lesson that I have... Well, I guess I didn't need really three. I don't know why I thought that. Um, that is a lesson that I have learned, hopefully, finally. Ooh, piece of wheat. Ooh, piece of wheat. Ooh, piece of wheat. Do I have the sprinklies? Yes, I do. Sprinklies. Sprinkle, 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 sprinkle. Oh. I really need to start keeping the hoe on me. Dang it. Alright, well, let's make some more cow babies. I'll take your free XP, please. Thank you. Yeah, all this hopping is just draining my food bar. Okay, let's, yeah, let's head out this way. I'm going to try not to sprint or hop. <laughs> and, uh, hello, horsey. Let's see if we can find where that, I don't want to go to that cave I was just in. I want to see, I still want to see if I can find the, the big cave that I came across. Giant hole. Holy smokes. That is a giant hole. Oh, this looks like something a horse could die in. Oh, man. I'm going to seal that up. Yes, I'd love to adventure in it, but honestly, that's going to require a lot of work for me just to not f die in there myself. And since the horses have started wandering out of the plains and into the swamp here, i gotta be, uh, I got to be aware of that. And those things really do wander. I mean, more so than... Okay, I need to run. This is too slow. More so than any other passive mob that I've seen. I don't know what it is in their in their DNA code that says, hey, wander aimlessly, but they do. I mean, remember Duncan? He went all over the place. All right, that's just a water... Underground water spring. All right, what else we got over here? Ooh. What is this? Is this... What is this? Anything? No, nothing spectacular. Okay. Ooh. That's... I don't know if this is it, because I thought... I swear I thought I marked it, but this might be... This might be worth investigating. Let's let's check this out. Uh, safe way down? Hmm? Hmm? All right, looks like over here is going to be the best way. OK, 
Okay. Ba -doop, ba -doop, boop, boop. Okay. And that goes there. That goes there. And there we go. Alright, let's mark this baby. Alright. Yeah, this is definitely not the cave I came across, but we'll take advantage of it anyway. Cool. Mmm, iron. Uh-oh. I hope he's not coming from over there. That would suck. I don't know. Do skeletons have the same... Oh, boy. Do they have the same sensory as, uh, as zombies? I... Oh, he's right up there. I don't think they do. I think... Zombies are the gifted ones. They could, uh, they can track you from, like, you know, 80 blocks or whatever it is away. Okay, let's bust out one here, and then... <laughs> Sucker. Oh, there's, like, a whole other, like, area up there. Or a room or something. Let's mark that. Oh yeah, that might be worth checking out. Okay, end of the road. Cool. Well, I'm okay with that. I'm going to need a ton of coal to get started anyway. Because we're going to need... Um, what, else, what are we going to need? We're going to want to get some enchanting going soon. We're going to need... Because I want to get my... To I want to keep my tools as long as possible and... So I'm going to need to find some diamonds, and I haven't talked to anybody else, but, you know, I, I'm sure a, I'm sure another hub will be, you know, on the docket as well. Oh, no. It's nighttime. I'm going to have to write it out. Uh, didn't realize I was gone for that long. It's funny. It seems like whenever you're, you know, you're ill prepared to survive the night, that's when daytime goes the fastest, and and nighttime just conquers you. But when you're super geared, and it lasts forever. I don't know why that is. Uh, let's see. I have no intentions on doing another Ender Ender. It was a great project, and I think it was a great success. But, as much as I love it, I, I, I've done one of those before, but that one was, like, the best one. Mm, excuse me. But, it, I, I find that it's almost, I, I'm almost put out, because I'm like, oh, I gotta go all the way over there. You know, whereas if I have something that's like a, uh, like what I had with the XP machine at Desolot, you know, something that's just local that I can go do and be around. Like if I'm farming and I'm always within range of it and it's constantly producing mobs for me to kill, then I feel more inclined to to do that because I don't have to leave, you know? All right, let's, let's swing toward... We'll, we'll come back for that call. Let's swing back the other way. Oh, hello, creeper, creeper. Blow up, blow up. Blow up, blow up. Nope, Okay. Ooh. And another, oh, geez, and there's one, there's an area behind us here. Oh, man. Yep, there's a creeper in there. We're going to seal this part off. And, geez, cow, you're scaring me. And we're going to go see about this skeleton over here. Yay! Gravel leads to good things. I think it's the only time you ever hear anybody be excited for gravel because it's not a, not exactly a popular block. I mean, it's definitely useful in the sense of you get. Um, I hear a slime. Ooh, iron walked right by it. Um, you get flint from it for making arrows early on. But beyond that, I think that's where the its usefulness ends. Uh, it's it's definitely a good uh, and popular 
a decoration block for roads, but... Okay, the slime is probably just above me, because I think I still am in the swamp. No, I'm in forest. Well, he still could have wandered. Okay. Well, I think I will end the episode here. I'll clean this up, and if anything cool happens, I'll I'll just start up with that uh, in the next episode. So, all right, guys, we'll see you in the next one.